we're not going to focus on OCD and we're just going to start. So, what's up guys and welcome to another video. Let's get ready to wake up and react to another episode of Full Metal Alchemist. Season 1, ep or well, it's all one season, but episode 17. Um, and I'm going to do Hunter Hunter later. Mm. For Patreon, not YouTube. You're probably not getting Full Metal and Hunter Hunter on YouTube the same day. Um... Anyway, so, okay. Oh, I don't think I posted this on YouTube, but, um, I'll say it now for when this is posted, you'll get this. Uh, I'm going on vacation November 8th through the 14th, so I'll be leaving really early November 8th. My flight's at 6 a.m. around there, so we gotta leave. The airport's like an hour away, so we have to leave, like, three hours before the flight, so I'm gonna be up, like, 1 a.m. Um, and then, uh, we're coming back on the 14th, uh, but I won't be back until, like, probably, like, 7 p.m., 7 or 8, uh, no, 7, 7, 7, 7, not 8, 7, anyway, so I don't know if I'll be uploading that day, I'm probably not gonna upload the day I leave, and I'm probably not gonna upload the day I get back, so... The latest upload will probably be the 7th, like, before I leave, and then the earliest when I get back will probably be the 9th, um, for YouTube slash Patreon. So, yeah, just wanted to let you guys know that I'm going on vacation. So, that week, you, you're either gonna get a few uploads, not a lot, maybe, like, two to three each i'm gonna try to stockpile some uploads so that i can just and have them all uploaded before i leave because i don't want to bring my laptop god forbid something happens i want to leave it here um but anyway so yeah i want to leave it here so i'm gonna have to try to get everything uploaded so hopefully no copyright issues before i leave the day before i'll try to figure that all out before i leave though so you guys can at least get something while i'm gone but if i don't because you guys know i procrastinate if I don't get it done, I'm sorry, then I guess you're not getting anything that week. But I'm I'm hoping that you can at least get one thing. At least one. Ugh, okay. But anyway, last time on Full Metal. Oh, what happened last time? Because I added episode 15 yesterday, so I'm trying to... Or not yesterday. Day before yesterday, I think it was. But I'm trying to, like, remember what happened after that. Um, Roy, yeah, so I think Maria or Ross or whatever her name is, she got arrested, so, for the murder of Hughes, and then the boys found out, and Winry, they found out that he's dead, so now they're trying to, like, deal with that loss and the guilt that comes with it because they feel like if they never would have told him anything... He never would have been involved and he never would have died. Because they wouldn't have killed him because he had no information. It makes sense, but... I feel bad. I feel bad for the boys. You know, they didn't they didn't anticipate that happening. They're just kids. They, they're not familiar with all that stuff yet. Of like, okay, maybe I shouldn't tell this person because then they may be murdered. They haven't experienced that yet. So that it's a learning experience for them. But, um... I don't think much else happened. Unless I just can't remember. Well, I'll probably talk about it once the video starts playing. I'll remember something. But anyway, remember to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And if you guys want full reactions, you can catch them on my Patreon. Other than that, let's jump into the reaction, guys. It was at point blank range. Close enough that even yeah, Maria Ross, I was right. I wasn't sure about her name. I had the day off. I was at my parents' house visiting. Please check with them. They'll tell you. All you can offer us is your family's testimony. What else is she? As an alibi. What? Why the Take fuck not? That's how I know you're envy, you sketchy ass motherfucker. Why doesn't that? Why? Because her parents could lie for her. Who else? Anyone she asks, they're, you're just gonna say the same thing. Oh, they could have lied for you. Oh, they could have lied for you. It doesn't matter who she asks. I already know this is such a fucking setup, bro. 
oh, I hate this shit. I hate when they do this because no matter what evidence they come up with that proves their innocence, they just find a way to say, no, it's a lie. It could have been faked. It could have been, I don't know, dude. Oh, oh, my blood pressure's already like, whoa, I want my phone. I want to look up and see if that's Weiss before I forget, even though I know that's not really important right now, but I don't know where my phone is. I see it. I'm going to grab it because I know, you know, she sounds like her. No, but they sound exactly alike. Anyway, I uh, just got spoiled on something. I'm Maria Ross. I'm sure you guys all know what it is. I hate that. You start typing something and something else pops up. Well, now I'm not going to be surprised when that happens. Oh, I'm kind of triggered. I'm mad at myself. I should, never should have looked that up. Fuck. Uh, uh, now my reaction's gonna suck, man. I bet you it happens this episode, too. Alright, whatever. I can corroborate her. Lieutenant Ross and I both fired around from our weapons at the 5th Laboratory to defend the Elric brothers. You did? Yes, and it's all written in my report. But everyone's ignoring it, sir. Mm, of course they are, because this shit's a setup. I'm trying to frame the second lieutenant for this? Yes. Put it together. Come on. Oh, shit. Oh. Dang. Cold flame. Roy? Or someone else? Or... What's with the face? I'm just surprised. You've never asked for my advice before. Mm. I'm scared, you know? Right now, I've been off somewhere fighting and digging up information. Information that could get you killed like Mr. Fuchs. Yeah. I think about that. It terrifies me. I mean, you could die. I'd still be here, and you'd just suddenly not be there anymore. Yeah. It's almost more than I can handle, thinking about that. Honestly, sometimes I wish you would just pick this whole thing up. They can't. You know they can't. I to get your bodies back. But I also want you to stay alive and safe. I understand, when I, I get it, yep. I'm not sure what I think you should do. I really don't know. You should be nice, Winry. <laughs> For a change, because you're not really. All right now, you see how she's acting? She's <laughs> just proving his point, Winry. Okay, I get it though. She's embarrassed. <laughs> I'm always nice. What are you, what are you talking about? <coughs> False. But anyway, um, it is a tough position, though. Really, it is. What do you say when someone asks you that? I mean, they're just going down this path. I mean, it's so dangerous, I know, but they've... <laughs> Ed has this guilt, man. He... I cost my brother his body. Now Hughes is dead because of the information that we asked him to... Or, yeah, we, yeah I think they did ask him to help. But because of that, he's dead. Now, if I don't do anything, what did he die for? Nothing. If I just give up, I have to keep trying. That's... If Ed would just give up, I would, I wouldn't like that. I mean, so it's kind of cowardly in a way. Like, okay, so now you don't want to die, but it's okay for him to die looking for the information. No. I, it's hard though because, like she said, you want them to stay safe, but you also want them to get their bodies back, and this is the only way to do it. You can't just not look for the information. You have to, and looking for that information comes along with being targeted um, to be killed because they don't want you to find that information. But <sighs> man, if only they weren't linked, you know, looking for the information and being killed, or you know, people attempting to kill you. Ugh. So you can't tell them no, you can't tell them don't do it, because she understands why they're doing it. I like that she can at least, she says it, I understand why you're doing it, I can't tell you to stop, but I do wish you would just stop, because I just want you to stay safe, but I know that they, you just can't, and I get it. 
I understand. So I won't tell you stuff. I I don't know. I respect that. She's she understands and she's not trying to stop them. Uh my poor boys. What's uh -oh. happening? We've got an intruder. Come on, give us a hand. What? Behave yourself. Got it? I will. We're about to find out if he can really use out. Lame, oh. lame, lame. Are oh my god, he actually try? showed up. You can do better than that. He still coming at us. The guns don't even dent him. Hold it. Stay Ooh, back. The information he's gonna take in. Yes. See? <laughs> He's like Ed. Oh, they don't know that. Oh. Where did you say you were from? Shing, east of the desert. Oh shit! Come what? I'd be happy to. Why? Are you from the same place? Why did he let him out? When he heard where he was from, hmm. they're gonna break her out or something? Oh. He's not gonna hurt her. According to the newspapers, you're one guilty soldier girl. It can't be. Oh, but it is. Right now, it's looking like you'll be facing the firing squad for sure. It's not true. They're wrong. If they would just do a proper investigation. They won't. You choice. know they're all sketchy. Be killed for murder or bust out of this joint with me. Which will it be? Get out of here. Get out of here, bitch. Is there anything else I can do? Don't stay here. You're like you're gonna be murdered for sure. If you stay here, because they're all dirty. Go! Fine, let's go. There we go. Because Smart girl. Let's go. With you. Let's go! No way out of here, metal boy. Maria Ross has broken out. Good. Oh, a smart decision. They must be I don't care if it makes her look she more guilty. The order is shoot to kill. Oh, fuck, bro. Let her get away, please. Oh, is he gonna help them? Escape? Cold flame? Just keep about to break that move out or something? <gasps> Boys, help her! Help her get away! Yes, exactly! Let's go! Don't- Oh my god, please! Yes, exactly, run! Stay back! It's not a bad dude, he's actually fucking nice. No! You better not kill her, she didn't do it! You're Maria Ross, right? Roy, she didn't do it! <gasps> what was that? Looks like they got her. No! Hold it. Get back here! Ah. This me. Let's go, foreigner! What do you mean they got her? Like, as in your friends got her, and like they're they're making it look like she's dead or something? Boy, boy, no, nah, they faked her death. I don't believe it. They put that bracelet on that fake body. I don't believe that shit. That's not actually her. No fucking way. No fucking way. She's actually dead, bro. That's a fake ass body. I'm telling you, that's a fake body. Second Lieutenant Ross, why didn't you say anything? <laughs> you threaten a superior officer. What is your deal? Yourself, Roy, I hope this is on act. Please. This bastard just killed Ross. What? He did. <gasps> How could you do that, Colonel? Oh. Maria Ross was a fugitive. Our orders were shoot to kill. So I did. That's all you have to say? About Hughes's death. I apologize for hiding him. But you do not argue against orders. Or ask for explanations. Just follow them. That's what it means to be a soldier. Then I don't want to fucking be one. Sorry. You follow orders, don't ask questions. Okay, bitch, because that's not what you're doing, you hypocrite. Go ahead and tell them that. Oh. Ah, I'm triggered. I'm so triggered to the max. <laughs> okay, so he is being a raging hypocrite right now. Follow orders, don't ask questions. The fuck are you doing then, bro? With all this sketchy stuff.
Oh my god, I can't even speak. All this stuff you're doing behind the scenes, researching all these high up superior officials and shit, right? Superior officers. You're investigating. You're not just following orders without asking questions. You're asking a bunch of questions. I feel like you're telling them that to keep them safe. Like, you don't want them to do what you're doing because all it's going to do is get them into trouble and put them in danger. Because you said, like, last episode, I think, that you didn't want to tell them about Hughes' death because you just, you didn't want to, uh, hair looks like shit. You didn't want to hurt them any more than and put them through anything else and put any more on their conscience than they already have. I, I, I just don't believe, I don't believe you actually killed Ross, number one. And what the fuck are you two whispering about? No, I feel like this guy is telling you that's not really her body. He's putting on this, like, evil act towards the boys because then they'll go say, oh yeah, he killed her, she's dead. You know, he has a witness then. But I don't think he actually killed her. That was what I saw on Google, a Ross's death or something, so... But now I don't really think it's real. I don't. I really don't. I don't believe she's actually dead. Perhaps then it was one of your men who aided Lieutenant Ross's escape. One of my men? But why? Why, Colonel? I'll tell you why. So you could burn her to death with your own hand. You know he's on to you I too, so now you want to kill him too? Get the fuck out of here. I don't believe that's why they let her... I don't believe that's why they broke her out. I just don't. She's not dead, dude. You could easily fake that shit. And I don't think they have the, uh... I don't think they have the technology to prove that that is or isn't her. Like, with dental records and shit. So, they don't... I don't think they're that far advanced. Her body was almost completely destroyed. But judging from what little dental... Work Dang! Prove me wrong! This is indeed Marie. <gasps> it's an awful thing you did. Turning a beauty like her into a pile of charcoal. Are you shitting me? She's really dead? They really have that technology? Is this doctor in on this? Is he lying? I can't, dude. I don't believe he would kill her. Why would he? She has information that he would need, that he would want. She was so straightforward and earnest, compassionate, but truly fine officer. Yeah, she is. I don't believe she's dead. I don't. You had that doctor say that on purpose. You did. I'm saying this till the end. If I don't see her by the end of this episode, then maybe I'll believe she's dead. Is killed by Colonel Mustang, eager to avenge his best friend. And all's well that ends well. Yeah, you're so definitely that guy with the glasses. The plan was supposed to be designed to get Mustang to behave himself. <laughs> he took the bait. Now he doesn't have a reason to sleep around anymore. Mm. Besides, did he? Did he take the bait though? So He's pretty fucking awesome. smart. I don't He's believe he would do that shit. Trust me. Are you sure your assistant won't give you grief for blowing off work to talk on the phone? Mm. Nope, the coast is clear. She's Who the, the fuck is Elizabeth? The hmm. Care to come along? Is that Ross? Who the fuck is he talking to? Care to come along? Something's up. This music. Yeah, Something's gonna it? happen. What, you... what the oh, fuck God. is that about? <laughs> Yo, look, this episode's crazy. What is he doing? Good, no good at all. Your auto mail seems to be broken. Uh, okay. Yes, this is a serious situation indeed. We'll have to repair it at once. There's What's no going on? Allow me to escort you to Rizenpool for repairs. <sighs> Are you trying to get him out of here because something's going down? Something's going up, man. Put it out, Major. Put me down. <laughs> He's so little. I'm afraid I can't do that. These are my orders. Roy, what are you up to? What are you planning? This music. Roy. What are you doing? Finally, everyone's out of the way. Where's Ross? You've got plenty of manpower right here. You made them. You guys are fucked up, man. Bury the chopper. Another mass murderer or something. Oh, this review, I don't know how long it's gonna be. Fuck. Try to make it fast, but um so i can get this uploaded to you guys 
I think Roy did all this on purpose. You can easily pay the doctor to say what you want him to say. I don't think she's actually dead. Um, burn the body beyond recognition besides the dental records. Which I, you know, credit to them. I said right before they did it, I don't think they'll have the technology to prove it with dental records. And they did, so props to them. They're more advanced than I thought. Um, but yeah, I think he probably just told the doctor. He either paid him or the doctor's just on their side and said what he wanted him to say. And then the fact that he got orders from Roy, Armstrong got orders from Roy. I mean, come on now. You really think you would have taken orders from him if he hated him that much for killing Maria Ross? I don't think so. They're all in on this, except for Ed. Ed's about to be, I think. I don't know why Alphonse has to stay behind, but I guess just so it's not as suspicious or something. I don't know. But why are they going back to Reese and Bull? For what? What's there that they need to see? Are they going to go back to his dad's office and look through his books or something? I don't know. Something's there. He said everyone's out of the way. The girl he was talking to on the phone could have easily been Ross. They're speaking in code or something, maybe. Didn't sound like her, though. Sounded like someone different. <coughs> and then, uh... What was I going to say? I think he wanted all those people there. Because, okay... That guy that murdered the butcher broke her out. He let, tells her tells her to go down that exact alley that Roy's down. I mean, come on. Oh, and then he said, oh, looks like they got her. Like, making it seem like they got her. Like, they broke her out just so they could kill her. No, they got her so that they could get her away from here. They tied up that loose end, that storyline. Okay, now we're not going to have all this, you know... He said, she said, this drawn out maybe trial. I don't know if they would have one or not. You know, we tied up that storyline. Make them believe that I'm buying their bullshit, right? Because he knows. He knows about them and he's on to them. He knows they were probably setting all this up, right? So now that that's all done and over with and out of the way, we can go and work on these like little uh, secret missions to discover more information about them. I think that's what's going to happen now. That music, too, it's just such a... Just screaming at me that, like, this is, like, set up for something huge. This music was building up and building up and building up to something that's going to be a great arc, I'm sure. I just feel like we're about to get so much information. But yes, so, to summarize, Ross is not dead. Armstrong is in on the plan. Um, Hawkeye, I don't know if she left like that because she doesn't like this plan or... I, she has to know that Ross is not dead. I don't know what she's mad about, but I'm sure we'll figure it out. Um, what else? I think they're about to bring Ed in on it and don't know what they're doing other than going to the office. Uh, and now they're going to release... The Sins are going to release some other murderer now, it seems. I don't know if it's something that they created, because they kind of look like a chimera, so I guess they made another chimera. Mm. I feel bad for all these people they do that to, man. It's all against their will. But they all do it because it's what Daddy said. I'm sure they do things that are, that are not um, Father's orders. I'm sure they do a bunch of stuff that's just what they want to do or I don't know I just don't believe that everything they do is according to his plan they do some things in their own interest hmm what else happened anything else to comment on Ling's with them now I don't know what's gonna go on with that I don't know why he broke him out because as soon as he heard where he was from the butcher let him out I don't know if it's personal and that's why he broke him out like so he, he has some personal thing with Jing or if it's he, they heard about him, Roy's group heard about him, and they're like, oh, you, we need you. So, maybe. I'm not sure, though. I really hope I'm not wrong about this whole Ross thing. I mean, I think it would just be lame if they just killed her, the killer. That would seem, because that would just be, I don't know, underwhelming to me. Like, Roy, you're smarter than that. I, like, why, I just don't believe he would buy their bait. I just don't. I just, I just don't. Not with all that information that you have, you wouldn't, you just wouldn't, you wouldn't buy into that. Anyway, don't know what else to say. So, remember to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And if you guys want full reactions, you can catch that on my Patreon. 
Other than that, I'm going to get out of here, guys, and I'll catch you in the next reaction.